I, I want to I wanna read on. Lord, what will you give me? He, he's asking for some visible, touchable, seeable, smellable evidence. In other words, God, I heard what you said. But I'm struggling with this doubt that's in my soul. Oh, God. Abraham is saying, I've done what you told me to do. In Genesis 12, God spoke to Abraham. He said, leave your family. Leave your mama, your daddy, your cousins, your uncles, your family. And take up your stuff and go to a place that I will show you. So when Abram went home and told his wife, we're leaving, she asked him the question like all women do, honey, come, honey, come on, come on lady, honey, where are we going? I don't know. But God said he had a place for us. Well, what direction are we to go? I don't know. But I believe every step I take, every move I make, it'll be in the perfect will of God. So let's go. And he left out of obedience to God. Now he's struggling because God has promised him a son. And you got to realize when God promised Abraham a son, uh, Abraham couldn't go to CVS and get some Viagra. They didn't carry it in their local drugstore. And even if they carried Viagra, uh, Sarah, her womb was dead. You better hear me today. Because God doesn't care about a dead womb if you get a fresh word from Almighty God. Somebody better grab a hold of this.